Welcome to Open House. And uh, sorry about the noise behind me there. Uh, hey, so I'm Mr. Welty. Uh, welcome to CP Physics. And you can see back here, um, here is our website. Well, on Canvas, right? Um, and I've been really good at doing the uh, scheduling here on the front page. So you can always check on here and see what our schedule is day by day um, for each week. Um, I should say that I designed this course really with a remote mindset. That is that we would be remote all the time and kind of taking it from there. Um, so it's been really useful that students ha who have been out now can just follow right along just as if they would be in hybrid. Um, you know, also looking at hybrid being an opportunity for kids to come in and be able to ask questions and have more interaction um, and really be able to help them a bit more since I can't be, um, they can't do that from home very well. Um, I do want to say everything I've been doing for the last uh, seven, eight years now, I've been a flipped learning teacher um, and into project-based learning. So that's really helped me easily transfer and adapt to remote learning. Um, if you're not familiar with flipped learning, that is where I started making video lessons for students to watch at home. And then as they came into my classroom, they were much more active learners. Um, they would do problem solving together in groups um, with me there for help to ask questions. Um, so that's really made it easy for me to kind of make the jump to remote learning. Um, let's see what else I wanted to say. So let me take you on a little tour of just what how I've designed each week. Uh, if I click on modules right there, and we'll take you through, let's see, so everything's organized by the week, but let's take week six, I guess, because we just did that last week. Um, so if you look here on week six, you know, it says agenda for week six. Um, so every week there's an agenda posted of what students will be doing all week. Um, I like to start the week reviewing what we did the week before. So, you know, the week before we, so this week six was projectiles and we talked about free fall the week before. So we start off with a review. So a little practice quiz um, for them to do to see what they remember. Um, and then it's all in on Monday um, would be a video lesson for them to watch at home. Uh, they can be five to eight minutes um, of my video lessons where they can get the first introduction to the concepts and ideas for the week. So this would have been on projectile motion. Um, and then really when they come in, each week is scheduled very similarly. That is Tuesday, Wednesday, um, our activity days. So you can see here they were looking at some Mythbusters things, uh, motion projectiles, and then here's the activity uh, projectile motion um, on FET. So it's a simulation they were doing. Um, they could start it here or at home and then finish it here or at home. So that was a Tuesday, Wednesday. Thursday, Friday is when they actually work on problem solving. And uh, they can either start that at home or finish that here. Um, there's also videos to go through all the homework solutions that they have access to as well. And then on Friday is that week summary of everything they learned all week and to kind of put everything together. Um, there's questions there that are written questions. There's questions there that go back to practice problems and how they solve them. And that's really how every week is built. Um, so you step into any other week um, they're always going to do a homework video for Monday, on Monday, during remote, and then Tuesday, Wednesday, they come in, they're doing two days of act on that activity, Thursday, Friday are two days on problem solving. Um, and then we kind of repeat, so it's been pretty easy for students to kind of just um, know what to expect week in and week out. Um, I should say the other thing that we've been doing are digital portfolios. And if you have not seen your child's digital portfolio for physics, please ask them, um, because they're they're They've been really great. They've been phenomenal. It's a way students are documenting everything they're learning all term. Um, so they did, they've probably made about six slides on, on Google Slides. And, and these are really interactive digital portfolios where they've recorded audio of themselves, video of themselves talking about physics, um, and embedded some other video and images and things like that, things like that to support um, what they've done in class to illustrate what they've learned. Um, so check those out. Um, and I think that's about it for me. So thanks for uh, watching and learning a little bit more about college prep physics. And my email, obviously, is dwelty at ansboro.k12maus. Uh, thanks.